such a trout. Try to remember, you want to wet your hands. Cool. Yeah, I'll lift her. These two big guys here. Oh, huge perch. Oh. Hopefully it didn't swallow it. Oh, nice one. There you go. That's a good one there. Yeah. Man. Hello everybody, welcome to another adventure of LT Outdoors. Today I'm back at it up near Lewiston and I'm fishing a couple different lakes today. So just kind of trying to figure out new lakes. You know, I always love doing a new adventure and trying to learn new lakes, it's just fun. Always cool to see all the different structures everywhere. So yeah, hope you guys enjoy this. Let me know what you think and make sure if you haven't already hit that subscribe button. Oh, that was a good hit. You should come back for it. You didn't get on. Yep, there he is. Not by much, though. Uh, pretty little things. There we go. A little bit better. Oh my god! Oh, I didn't bring my scale. This thing is enormous. Oh my god, you gotta come see this, Mark. You gotta come see this. That is probably the biggest bass. Yep, they're hugging shore, man. <laughs> Dude, it's a freaking tanks, man. Oh, 20 and a half. Wow, what an awesome, ginormous fish right there, folks. <laughs> That was the biggest bass that I've caught this year, guys. That was 20 and a quarter. 20 and a half almost. He was over the quarter. And I don't have my dang scale. I'm sure he was over five pounds. The thing was a tank. Oh, another monster. Oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> yes. Away. <laughs> uh, love it. Love it, love it. Oh, 
Oh, he's got it. I didn't think he had it. Ow! <laughs> he stuck me good. I want to show you guys, too. This happens a lot, especially when your frog starts getting worn out, you know, like a worn pair of jeans or something. Don't think that it's destroyed. When I was younger and this happened, I threw away one that I thought was ruined. Don't be dumb. All right, all you got to do is spin that baby around, pull your skirt back through, and you are ready to rock and roll. Again, mess, mess the frog up, but you just spin it around and squeeze it back down underneath them hooks. Looks like another good one. No, little one. bluegill beds right here folks and these little baby bass are just Choking that white booyah. <laughs> I believe it was Bill Dance that originally started pushing these booyahs. He might even been the one that helped design it. Other one. Feels like a big one too. Oh yeah, look at this gill, guys. Gorgeous, look at that fish absolutely stunning that is on the panty harness lt outdoors panty harness tipped with the red freedom baits hornet Ooh, that might be a bass nope big gill wow 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 look at that Look at that. Beautiful fish. Oh. There we go, another big gill. These are good looking fish too, real clean. They don't have grubs or nothing. Ooh, that's another big gill. Big, big gill. I can see him in the water, he's pretty. I think these are all bulls guarding the nest. Look at that. 
Absolutely gorgeous, guys. Ooh, another good one. Another nice gill. Yeah, yeah, there's definitely an abundance of good eaters on this lake. They're averaging nice size. I'm sure the females, like I said, these are the males. I'm sure that if we could get into the females, they're probably really big, I'd imagine. All right, now I'm going to throw right along those logs right there. Actually, first I'm going to throw to the right of those logs. There's a pocket right there. Oh, I lost it. Wasn't very big, but still, it was a fish. Oop. Little bass. <laughs> Hard to beat, though, that splash. I mean, that's what it's all about frogging, is that topwater bite. You see, I rip them through those pads. That's why I'm reeling fast. Trust me, I'd rather fight them, but... You let them fight too hard in these pads and you're just gonna lose every one of them. Well, I've learned that the hard way. Every single day. <laughs> nope, it's on the panty harness. Again, the panty harness strikes again. Different lake. Trying out a new lake here. That's a big one. Definitely some good looking fish. Nice dark, pretty blue. Either. Sure felt big. <laughs> On that panty harness, they sure love that. Pretty fish. Just little bass. <laughs> little bass all over these bluegill beds. Shout out to my monthly patrons. Thank you guys so much for signing up to Patreon. 
Sign up today, guys. You can sign up for as low as a dollar a month, and it helps out a whole lot. This season at LT Outdoors has been brought to you by Freedom Baits. Go to freedombaits.com and use discount code LT Outdoors. Gets you 10% off. Also, Widowmaker Lures. My favorite lures are on this website. Go to widowmakerlures.com. Use discount code LT Outdoors. Gets 10% off. Stone Tackle. Make sure you go to stonetackle.com and check out the awesome jig boxes. They've got boxes that'll hold all of your jigs in one box. And use discount code LT Outdoors gets you 15% off. And Hizia.com. Check out Hizia for a great line of outdoor footwear. Use discount code LT15 gets you 15% off. And if you're looking to get LT Outdoor lures, you can visit these wonderful locations.